The Aildon Dam or Aildon Weir, a rock and earth fill embankment dam with a controlled spillway across the Goulburn River, is located between the regional towns of Mansfield and Aildon within Lake Aildon National Park, in the Alpine region of Victoria, Australia. The dam's purpose is for the supply of potable water, irrigation, and the generation of hydroelectricity. The impounded reservoir is called Lake Aildon. Location and features Designed by the State Rivers and Water Supply Commission of Victoria, construction of the original water storage, which was known as Sugarloaf Reservoir, took place between 1915 and 1929 to provide irrigation water for what was a vast uncultivated area on Victoria's northern plains. The dam was modified in 1929, and again in 1935 to increase the storage capacity to 377,000 megalitres 83 times 10 to the power of 9 imp gal, 100 times 10 to the power of 9 US gal. However, this reservoir was still limited in its capacity to meet the growing demand for water in the Goulburn Valley and to protect farmers during drought years. Following a detailed feasibility study of all possible storage sites on the Goulburn River, it was decided that the existing dam site was the most suitable for construction of a larger dam. In 1951, work began to enlarge the storage to its present capacity. The enlargement was completed in 1955 and the storage was renamed Lake Aildon. The embankment dam wall is constructed with an earth core and rock fill, rising to a height of 83 metres. The core component materials of the wall include 10,200,000 cubic meters, 360 times 10 to the power of 6 cu feet of rock and earth, with a catchment area of 3,885 square kilometers, 1,500 square miles, that includes the Goulburn, Delatite, Hauqua, Big, and Jameson rivers and several minor tributaries. The reservoir covers an area of 13,832 hectares, 34,180 acres. The reservoir has a capacity of 3,390,000 megalitres 746 times 10 to the power of 9 imp gal, 896 times 10 to the power of 9 US gal with an average depth of 24 metres 79 feet, and can release a maximum outflow of approximately 3,356 cubic metres per second 118,500 cu foot per second via its controlled spillway. The crest of the uncontrolled spillway is 288.9 meters, 948 feet AHD and is approximately 1085 meters, 3560 feet long. Lake Aildon is connected to the Metropolitan Water Supply of Melbourne, the state capital, via a pipeline from the Goulburn River. On average, 91% of the water from Lake Aildon goes to the Goulburn Weir and the Waranga Basin before it flows to irrigators in the Goulburn Valley system. Power generation Operated by AGL Energy, Aildon Hydroelectric Power Station is a hydroelectric power station that operates during the irrigation season from August to May. Its operation is mainly governed by release of water to meet irrigation demands, but it may also be operated during winter and spring when flood releases can be used to generate electricity. The power station can also be used to meet short-term emergency power needs resulting from industrial disputes or plant breakdown elsewhere in the state's power grid. Initially completed as part of the Sugarloaf Reservoir with just 15 megawatts horsepower of hydroelectric generating power, capacity was increased by 1957 to 120 megawatts horsepower through the installation of two 60 megawatts horsepower turbines. The first 67 megawatt 90,000 horsepower turbine was commissioned in 1956 and a second in 1957. In addition, there are two 7.5 megawatts 10,100 horsepower turbines. These were decommissioned in 1971 but recommissioned in 2001. These smaller turbines were relocated from the former Sugarloaf Power Station on the Aildon Weir, completed in 1929 and in use until work on the larger dam started in 1951. This renovation of the oldest turbines in 2001 led to a generation capacity of 135 megawatts 181,000 horsepower. 
a 5200 megaliters 1.1 times 109 imp gal 1.4 times 109 us gal pondage below the dam temporarily detains water discharged from the power station and regulates releases downstream to minimize variations in flow due to intermittent power generation in 1995 a small hydroelectric station with 4.5 MW 6, horsepower output was installed on the pondage. Aildon Power Station has four turbo generators, with a total generating capacity of 150 MW horsepower of electricity. It produces an average of around 225 GWh of electricity per annum. Topic. Drought and recovery During the drought years in Victoria in the 2000s, Lake Aildon rarely filled and the once thriving holiday destinations around the lake were unable to attract visitors, leading to considerable economic hardship. Although water is in great demand for agriculture, careful regulation has kept outflows fairly static. During November 2006 the lake dropped to a low of only 15% from the previous year level of 48.3%. After many years with below average rainfall, 2010 saw Lake Aildon receive above average rainfall and rose from 23% of capacity in May 2010 to be 82.5% as of March 2011. Topic: In film The nearby town of Bonnie Doon was the location for the holiday scenes in the movie, The Castle. Gallery See also List of dams in Victoria North-South Pipeline Goulburn River List of power stations in Victoria, Australia Eldon Pondage Power Station Rubicon Hydroelectric Scheme <laughs>